Welcome to this special issue of GLIA. Here, we discuss novel studies illuminating the extensive epigenetic mechanisms that shape the function of glial cells. After genetics, the process that arguably most influences the life of an organism and its subsequent progeny is the phenotypic adaptation of the organism to its surroundings, or epigenetics. This principle states that, while an organism's cells all share the same genes, each cell type can develop unique patterns of gene expression, resulting in diverse phenotypes. Epigenetics defines the fate of most cells in the human body, including the glia. The latest special issue of glia presents studies that illuminate the extensive epigenetic mechanisms involved in the development of glial cell identity and the determination of functional states in response to environmental signals. For example, the progressive lineage restriction of neural stem cells during the neurogenic and then gliogenic periods of brain development is characterized by the concerted deposition of repressive and activating epigenetic marks in specific genomic regions. Ultimately, those epigenetic changes are the ones that shape the transcriptional program of each cell into a long-lasting pattern of gene expression, characteristic for each lineage. Epigenetics also denotes the ability of each glial cell type to regulate gene expression in response to external signals, such as growth factors metabolites derived from the host microbiota, and mechanical signals. In response to those signals, glial cells modify the placement of DNA methylation or hydroxymethylation marks along the genome, either acetylate or methylate-specific amino acids in the tail of histones, and recruit chromatin remodeling complexes that use ATP to establish a specific transcriptional signature. While more glial epigenetic mechanisms are brought to light, many more remain undiscovered. Novel molecular imaging techniques are expected to shed further light on these processes, revealing possible links to glia-related neurological disorders and thereby helping develop therapeutic applications.